Hey guys, what's up? I haven't, I know I haven't, um, vlogged lately, but, um, I'm doing good. Uh, my sleeping patterns are all messed up and everything, so, yeah, I'm, I'm a night owl. I love, you know, staying up late and everything, but it's like I said, the sleeping patterns are all messed up. I'm tired right now, and so, yeah, <laughs> staying up and everything, watching the news on TV, and yes, I don't have cable, but I do have a Fire Stick, Amazon Fire Stick, and, um, and you have to connect it to the internet, so I do have that, so I've been watching, I downloaded an app on the uh, Fire Stick, um, called, uh, ABC 24-7 or whatever about the news. I had it on all day yesterday and all day during the night, but I turn off the TV itself because I don't want to have to reload it and all that stuff. So, turning it back on when I woke up this morning and it's still playing <laughs> with all the news stuff. So, um, anyways, um, Woke up and I saw it was raining. I heard it was raining. So we're now I think we're getting the outer bands of Dorian. So, but I don't, like I said, I don't think it's going to be, you know, I know it's not going to be a direct hit because it's going up north now. So, um, but yeah, we could get, it is, right now it is a little bit windy. It's not totally windy but it is a little, little just a little bit windy um they said about like around tonight i don't i can't remember the the time um when it says it's going to be um coming so just have to see but as soon as i get done with um filming this and blah 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 <laughs> Um, get this put up and everything. I might go ahead and take a nap and everything just to because you know my eyes are still feel a little heavy Like I said, I'm a night owl. I love to stay up late and everything so <laughs> So that's why I'm like mm, So freaking dark. So anyways, um Anyways, I just want to catch you up on me Yes, I um, I did you know this is what I normally do I don't go out I don't want to spend money because one thing I don't have a job and I don't have the money so I do it myself um, I do shave my head this is the style I, I do every single time when I do shave um, it's a lot cooler it's a lot of take it's easy for me to take care of. and I've been doing this for I want to say five or six years because my mom back then she was diagnosed of uh, breast cancer and um, and you know they had to do a lot of treatments the chemo and radiation and she um, was losing her hair so but she decided to go ahead and have them shave her head because she was losing her hair anyways so during that time she was getting bald every single day and because of the treatment that she was doing and so sorry it's kind of hard for me to talk about it but um so um, but then, you know, after she, she couldn't take the treatment anymore because it was just, it was just taking so much effect on her and she couldn't take care, you know, take it and everything. So it was, she's, it was like a new treatment that they were experimenting on her, whatever. And then later i don't know how many years after she had you know had breast cancer um it came back um to stage four stage four bone cancer and 
um, that's when it, sh it started really taking effect and she could not fight it anymore and that's when I took care of her all this time um, living with her you know I always I mean I lived with her regardless and I took care of her and it started getting worse and worse and she could not you know take it anymore she couldn't fight it anymore so yeah I did take care of her I took I took her to doctor visits whenever she needs to go whenever she has doctor's appointments <clears throat> and if I went to church and of course she wants me as soon as um church got over with I came had to come straight home I can't you know stand around and talk to people she won't let me she wanted me to come home straight away from church so and um I told her I says well if you want me to go get something to eat and bring it back let me know and she said so she text she um called and left me a message yeah call you know get go there and come home straight home I was like okay and she, you know um that's what I did and of course I went to get groceries for her you know it was just you know constant thing and um she knew that I like to sleep in a little bit you know a little bit more in the morning and I told her since about I think it was eight or nine o'clock in the morning my time if people are different time zone um and she knows I was going to, you know, get up around that time to help her do whatever. And this is like when she started getting worse and she was, she was at home. And, but she could, she had to go to the bathroom. Now, I know this, um, she should wear depends when this happens because, you know, yeah, because this is like worse and... So, she went to the bathroom and she was, you know, I was like in a deep sleep during this, in the morning and stuff like that. And I was, you know, I didn't know what time it was. I think it was time for me, almost time for me to get up. I think it was like around 7, in between 7 o'clock in the morning to 8. Um, it's not time for me to get up and I was going to get up at 8. So, but I'm, you know, I was in a deep sleep. I was, you know, laying in my bed and everything. And then she calls out my name and then I started coming to and um she said and I'm hearing my name Allison she's yeah yelling Allison and I'm like I was literally I was pissed off <laughs> I was like it was a deep sleep <laughs> but I know I had to take care of her but I was really pissed off at the time and um and she was in the bathroom she was in my bathroom and everything, and um, and I say, why can't you just wait for me to get up? And says, I'm sorry, but I can't get up and everything. So I had to, I tried to pull her up, but I could not. And then I say, like, I need to call someone to help me, and because I cannot, you know, pick her up, um, you know, pick her up. I mean, get her off the toilet and everything. So. She said, call Diane. I said, well, I don't know if she's home because you can't rely on her if she's not home. But I'll call her. I was going to call 911, you know. So, but I did call Diane Coward, our, you know, her good friend, my good friend too, but her good friend mostly. She, thankfully, thank, pray that she was home and she was, that she, you know, she came over, she dropped whatever she was doing, and, she, you know, she was a nurse back, you know, and she's, like, retired, but she's still a nurse, you know, back then, but, um, she stopped what she's doing, she came, you know, here at my house, and, um, came and got, you know, helped me pick her up off the toilet and everything to help her, you know, clean up and everything. That's when I lost it that day and when um diane was there and um so we you know brought her back to the chair and the, and the porch and everything because she was sitting out there mostly all her time and we brought a chair out there for her like a recliner kind of type thing i think david moved it my brother um, moved it out there for her to sit in because she was out there mostly not watching TV and lo looking outside which is like an open kind of type thing 
um, watching whatever, you know, so brought her back and everything. I was, I was seriously, I was at a breaking point. Um, I just like, I, I was like, me, I was fed up. I mean, I was like literally fed up. I love my mom dearly. You know, I love my mom and dad. I miss my dad more than anything, but I do miss my mom too. Um, but I just could not deal with this, um, taking care of her, stuff like that. And I was at the, really, I was at the breaking point. And, um, and then I, you know, I had to get out of there since Diane was there and stuff like that. And, um, you know, stuff like that. I had to get out. And then, of course, thankfully, Miss Wanda, another good friend of ours, um, came over. She was, um, uh, help doing something, to, you know, putting lotion on her feet because, you know, mom couldn't do deal with that because her ankles were swollen and all that stuff. And, um, so I, you know, left the room and Diane Coward, even though Miss Wanda was here now, um, Diane had to leave and everything to go back home. And she, you know, I, she saw me go and, and she said to mom, my mom said, I'll be right back and everything. And, um, excuse me. So, and then, um, Diane says, are you okay? And I said, and I started, literally, I started breaking down in tears. I was crying my eyes out. And I said, I can't deal with this anymore. I wish somebody was helping me, like, staying here, something, because I can't deal with this. And, um, I mean, I'm trying my best, and I was trying my hardest to, you know, take care of my mom, all this stuff. Sorry. <laughs> so... But anyways, um, you know, Diane finally left. Miss Wanda was there taking care of her. And then the therapist came and all that stuff. It was just, you know, but finally they took her to the hospital because I don't know what happened. And then, uh, yeah, and then she went to hospice as the comforters for them to take care of her. This is at the slow process of dying. So it's just heartbreaking. <laughs> so... Yeah. Anyways, I'm just getting off on that. <laughs> um, let's see. He's about talking about something else. <laughs> but I was thinking about, you know, later on tonight, I'm thinking about doing a live stream. Um, I was thinking about making up, um, like, what days and what time I should do my live stream. And, um... What do you guys think? Um, leave a comment down below or yeah, leave a comment down below what what time and what days I can do a live stream. I could do it twice a day if you want me to. Um, I know Penny um, lives in the UK and she probably won't you know come on while I'm doing it at nighttime here. Um, say if I get you know if I do a live stream at seven o'clock p.m. my time, Easter time, Standard Time, she'll probably be asleep anyway, so, um, yeah, let me know if you, you know, I could do two, like I said, I can do two live streams, one during the day, like in the morning or whatever, and when people are in the UK, they can come by or whatever, um, and I could do one at night, let me know, I'll, 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 I'll do it, I'll make it, you know, make an arrangement, since I'm trying to find a job until then. So um, I'll make arrangements to do two in one day. Maybe one day a week doing it. Twice a week doing it. I don't know. Just let me know so I can see about fitting in my schedule. Yeah, what schedule? But no, I'm, I need to start doing like maybe, you know, stuff like that. But hopefully I get more... Um, people watching my live stream because if I do it and everything I maybe get like one or two <laughs> so
So, and I mean, you know, there are other people are doing their live streams during while I'm doing the live stream. So, um, yeah. So, let me know what time I should do it. And, um, yeah. I'll put it, I'll, you know, I'll do it. So, basically, like I said, I've been watching the news. Most, I mean, mostly the weather and stuff like that. Um, but like I said, right now... It's sunny. We're still we're getting the outer bands now, but they probably said like in during tonight maybe during the night or whatever tonight we might get more outer band rains. So and I'm I'm think I am hungry, so I might go out and get something to eat and bring it home. I don't know. Maybe I'll do a review on whatever I bought. Maybe another um. <laughs> Impossible burger. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, that's a good burger. But, you know, I don't know what I want. I'll have to figure that out. But I am hungry. So I'm going to go ahead and go. I might work on my uh, my diamond painting today. I don't know. But we'll see. But anyways, no, I haven't vlogged or in a while. So I thought maybe, you know go ahead and do that sorry I got kind of emotional talking about my mom and everything but that was a different story um it that was unexpected so I'll talk to I'll make another vlog on that and everything so alrighty I'll <clears throat> I'll let you go and I'll put this out so um trying to and also I'm trying to catch up on my YouTube my favorite YouTubers videos that I, you know, with me trying to catch up and me worrying about this weather, which I'm not worried about. I'm just watching them on, on TV, doing things around the house and um, stuff like that, you know, feeding the, the kittens and blah, blah, blah. And um, so, yeah, but I'm going to go ahead and go so I can put this video out. Like I said, I'm probably going to take a little nap after I get done with this and stuff like that. So, I'll take to get, I'll talk to you guys later. And, um, maybe I'll vlog tomorrow, hopefully. But I am charging my battery just in case, just in case, if the, if the power does go out, I'll have a charged battery. So, yeah. We'll see. But if I can't vlog or do live streams, you'll know why. I'll tweet it saying I can't do live or go and do anything because I don't have any power. Blah, blah, blah. And once my power comes back on, I'll let you guys know to, on that too. So, But I am keeping updates on, on Twitter um, with you guys what's going on, if anything. So, Alrighty, I'll talk to you later. And take care, guys. Peace.